All right, welcome back, guys, to Hayes Tech ROM Reviews. Um, today, I'm not going to go over a ROM uh, this time. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do, like, an unboxing for you guys. Uh, I don't like doing... I, I actually don't even like to watch unboxings. <laughs> to be honest, I hate them. Um, I know there's a lot of uh, a lot of you that do. You want to know what you're getting when you buy a product. Um, and this here is the next book, 8 uh, Aries 8A. Uh, you can get these at Walmart for under $70, guys. They got 1 gig of RAM. Um, I think it's a 1.6 uh, quad-core processor in them. Uh, they're actually not a bad tablet. Um, if I had to kind of, you know, uh, weigh them between tablets, I'd say they're very, very close to the Amazon tablet that you can get the Amazon Fire, uh, the Kindle Fire 7, um, which you can get those for like 50 bucks. And guys, get one. If you can still get one, dude, get it. Don't let it update though. Get it, you know. Put uh, go to Root Junkie's uh, website and uh, root, rootjunkiedl.com and uh, and and do what he does. Do what I've done. Uh, root them right away. Don't let it update. Anyways, we're talking about the next book, uh, Aries 8A. Um, I'm just gonna go real quickly. Uh, we are gonna unbox it. Oops, dropped my knife. And. Slice, ouch, slice that baby open. And pull this out like that. Tell you guys, you're not going to get much out of this. I'm guessing maybe a charging brick and cable. Yep. Uh, charging cable. Standard brick. And if my old ass eyes don't deceive me. It is a uh, 1.5 uh, 1.5 watt, so it's not even two watt uh, or amp. Excuse me. No, it is two amp. This is a two amp charger. Okay. Yeah, it says right there. It's uh, I can't read the rest of that. A 5.2 volt by two amp, but that's not bad. I was yeah, I was planning on one one and a half or even one amp. So that's that's not bad at all. Uh, it comes in a wrapper. The tablet and pretty much just paperwork. So we're gonna get rid of this. We don't need it. I'm not gonna do the whole pulling off of the screen saver. If it even has one. Oh yeah, it does. Let's get rid of that. And you know what, guys? I'm gonna put up a stand here so I can act actually manipulate this a little bit. I don't want to lose my Batman claw. <laughs> Thank you, John, for that. That's pretty cool. Um, this is a little <laughs> something a friend of mine sent. So, anyways, um, here's the tablet, guys. It's a standard 8-inch tablet. Uh, nothing really special about it. Uh, I did get it in the titanium gray. Uh, it's kind of got a textured back. It's plastic. Uh, it's got two buttons, power, and then your rocker switches. Power and rocker switches here, up, down. Um, and all your ports are up on top. There's nothing on the bottom or the sides. Let me show you. Sides, bottom, and then here's the side with the, the rockers. Uh, but what does come with this tablet, which doesn't come with a lot of tablets, uh, you do get your uh, 3.5 um, uh, micro, or not your micro, <laughs> your uh, uh, earbuds adapter, and of course uh, external mic if you're using one, like what I'm using on my Nexus 6, uh, which actually I'm not. Well, you know what? We're not going to do it now. Um, and uh, this square slot here, that's for your SD card. Uh, this is an HDMI out port, and this is your USB, um, micro USB adapter for charging it and stuff. And it's a standard. It's not a C-type or anything like that. So uh, if you guys have any adapters uh, lying around the house, uh, they'll all work. I can see there's a microphone port there as well. I don't see any other microphone ports here's your speaker <laughs> that's gonna be lovely um but again guys i was just looking for something else um you know to to root throw some custom roms on maybe even build one if, if there's nothing available uh i may i may build one uh it's not really that hard to do uh now that i know how to do it, it used to be i didn't know how to do oh you know what i should put that what's really cool about this is putting the sd card in 
you basically just pop it in there and push it until it clicks just like that see guys it was that simple so I'm gonna go ahead and let that boot see if I can't center that a little bit more and I might even do a little bit of work on the camera to get it to come in a little bit closer and let me pull this in a little bit go like that there we go that's about perfect all right so let's go ahead and go into settings uh, I can see this detected the uh, Samsung um, micro US or micro SD card I put in it which was a 32 uh, from what the box says is it will go up to uh, 168 uh, or 128 gig so uh, I don't have a 128 here to try it um, but I'm sure that it, it will if it uh, says so so we're gonna go to about tablet uh, it is a well this says Android 601 I hope that's not a problem because it wasn't supposed to be 601 it was supposed to be 501 at least the display model was um, so I might be SOL uh, rooting this thing so we'll have to see all right guys that's the unboxing uh, that's the tablet uh, if I do get it rooted um, I will I'm gonna try to do the video on it let you guys see how I root it that's if I can get it rooted now I was uh, under the impression it was 501 not uh, uh, not marshmallow. So, uh, I may have some issues, so we'll have to see. Anyways, guys, uh, if you liked the video, uh, give it a thumbs up. Uh, I do want to thank all of my subscribers, and I will see you guys on the next one.